Now, there could be some good news on the horizon for millions of animals that have to suffer from animal testing for the sake of human beings. Researchers in the U.S. have discovered what could be an alternative to the process that could not only reduce animal deaths but also make testing more accurate. Our Konzowa has this report. It's a common sight at laboratories. Mice, cute rabbits, as well as one of mankind's best friend, the dog. More than 100 million animals worldwide become victims of experiments for humans. But in many cases, test results are not that accurate since animals have different structures, functions and metabolisms. One of the things that pharmaceutical industry is finding is that they're having very high failure rates and often it's because the animal models being used to develop these drugs are not predictive of the human situation. That's why it is essential to experiment with tissue as similar to the human body as possible. To do that, a research team at the Wies Institute for Biologically Inspired Engineering at Harvard University planted human organ cells onto a thumb-sized chip. This is the idea of replacing animal studies for drug testing, for example, with little micro-engineered devices that are lined by human cells and reconstitute organ level function. The researchers created a thin membrane with a hole in it and implanted lung cells on top of it and vessels beneath it, giving the chip channels for oxygen and blood to flow and making the chip mimic a lung's breathing movements. This institute is by far the greatest and you know best working environment for bioengineering research and we can predict the behavior or response of these cells or the body to, for example, drugs more precisely. The research team also succeeded in kidneys on a chip, bone marrow on a chip and heart on a chip. And they say these chips could not only significantly reduce animal deaths but also signal large cuts in future costs and time needed to produce new drugs. Konsoa, Arirang News.